Hello Ervnen, thank you very very much for joining me today. Welcome to the Complete Ethical Hacking Masterclass. My name is Alexis Ahmed and I'm going to be your instructor for the course. I'm also the CEO and founder of Hackersploit. Hackersploit is a cybersecurity company that deals with penetration testing and ethical hacking training. So the question you might be having right now is why should I be taking this course instead of the plethora of the other courses that exist on Udemy? Well, I can put it really, really simply as the fact that this course is based on practicality and the reality of the ethical hacking scene. I've also been a student and I still am a student of ethical hacking, always learning. And uh, what I really found uh, before courses, online courses came to be, was that reading books and reading text wasn't going to cut it. And that's what I found on Udemy. This course was designed and it is the compilation of all my videos about ethical hacking, more specifically about penetration testing, put together for the purpose of educating people on the reality of ethical hacking and again being focused on the practicality of the subject because that's what ethical hacking is. It's based on the practicality of a situation which in this case can be put into two uh, levels, ethical hacking, uh, penetration testing in the realm of cybersecurity. So again, the question comes to be, why should I be taking this course? And as I've said, this course is going to be focused on practicality. You're going to be doing instead of reading. That's what I want from this course. I want you to learn by doing, and that's how I learned by doing. So I want, I want that to be transferred over to you. All right, we'll be taking a look at real hacking scenarios. Now, what do I mean by this? We'll be taking a look at exploiting real exploits. For example, the Eternal Blue exploit that was released by the, or was leaked from the NSA that allowed the exploitation of Windows 7 operating systems. Stuff like that. We'll then be taking a look at industry standard frameworks like Metasploit, how to use Metasploit for a, for the full penetration testing, uh, experience. We'll be then focusing on anonymity and just not simple anonymity. We'll be looking at proxy chains, how to set up a VPN, how to set up a VPN in, uh, in regards to using proxy chains as well. We'll be then moving on to information gathering techniques, more specifically the Nmap tool. We'll be looking at how to use Nmap for advanced information gathering as well as basic information gathering. We'll then be moving on to vulnerability analysis, how to perform vulnerability analysis on web servers, etc., etc. We'll then be moving on to exploitation. Now, why is exploitation so important to me? Well, that's because I deal with exploitation. Hackersploit is a company that deals with penetration testing and web application penetration testing. So I know the both of the sides of it in terms of client side attacks and server side attacks. We'll be looking at all the frameworks. We'll be looking at Hydra. We'll be looking at the, at the BEF framework as well. We'll then move on to something that is quite popular as well, and that is wired and wireless attacks. How to perform ARP spoofing, how to perform ARP poisoning, and finally, how to crack the WPA and the WPA2 uh, encryption with different methods and methods that do work using Aircrack and Airgeddon to perform the pixie dust attacks. We'll be then looking at something that not a lot of courses cover, which are DDoS attacks, how to perform them and how to protect yourself against them. We'll be then moving on to network sniffing, how to use Wireshark to capture packets on a network. And finally, looking at the last stage of ethical hacking and my favorite, which is post-exploitation, we'll be looking at creating backdoors, how to clear your tracks, we'll be looking at privilege escalation, and how to maintain access within a system. We'll be then moving on to, again, one of my favorite, which is remote access tools. And if you do not know what a remote access tool, do not worry, we'll be covering what exactly it is in that section of the course. We'll be then looking at how to get rid of rootkits from Linux operating systems and Windows operating systems. And finally, as I've mentioned, we'll be looking at real world exploits. We'll be focusing on real vulnerabilities. For example, the crack attacks that allowed the WPA2 encryption to be broken. Well, not broken, but exploited. We'll be then looking at the Eternal Blue exploits and so much more. So what can I promise you? with this course? Well, first of all, as I said, I'm going to be giving you a fully practical course. And secondly, this course is not about sales. I'm not going to be pushing you to buy this course. This course is going to be distributed free of charge one week for one week every month. And uh, if you choose to buy this course, you're supporting us and the work that we do. This course is not going to be focused on sales. And if you do happen to buy the course, and you're not satisfied with it, you can get a refund within 30 days as of you, as of when Udemy uh, allows this to happen if you purchase the course 
and you want a refund within 30 days. I'm pretty sure you know the terms that exist. And I just want to end uh, this introduction or welcome to the course by, you know, quoting one of my favorite quotes uh, by Benjamin Franklin. And that is, tell me and I'll forget, teach me and I remember, involve me and I learn. And that's exactly what I want to do in this course. I want to involve you in hacking. I want to show you how it's really done. I don't want to focus around spreadsheets and, uh, you know, presentations and talking to you about numbers and information and theory. I want you to learn by actually doing and I'm going to end it there by saying thank you for watching this video so far. And if you do choose to take the course, welcome and I'll be seeing you in the first video. Goodbye.